Welcome to the American Association Whip Around on this Wednesday. A full slate of action, including one day game in Winnipeg. The Cougars and Gold Eyes wrapping up their set. And what a series finale it was. Check this beautiful swing out from Max Murphy, the veteran with a two run shot to tie the game at two, but in the eighth, still knotted up. Kane County takes the lead. Harrison Smith with a solo shot just over the wall in left. So Winnipeg down one going into the ninth. Gio Brusa grounds it and it gets through into right field. Two runs come in to score. The Gold Eyes walk it off and win four to three. Down south to Cleburne and Brian O'Grady joins the double digit home run club. His 10th of the year, a no doubter, but this night belonged to Gary. Francisco Del Valle with his first home run of the year, a two run shot. The Railcats cruise to a 12 to five victory. To Sioux Falls, another good one between the Monarchs and Canaries. Check out Josh Bissonette racing home and scoring on the infield single in the seventh. Later on in the ninth, Trevor Achenbach ties it up. He comes through to knot it up at four. We go to extras and the first pitch of extras is blasted out by Frankie Tostado. Monarchs win six to five. To Fargo, another good West Division game here in the fourth. This is Daniel Montano clearing the bases with a double. And later on, Sioux City with a six to five edge. Daniel Perez tacks another one on top of that. Explorers win nine to five. To Lincoln, the Dockhounds searching for a much needed victory. And Mark Kloop would help him get there. Reinserted into the lineup after a brief injury absence. He's back and hitting bombs. And Josh Altman later in the game continues his success in his former home. The Dockhounds hang on to win 11 to 9. Finally to Milwaukee, the Dogs and Milkmen are in tight ones every time they match up. Dusty Stroop with a two-run ground will double here to give Chicago the lead. Later on down 8 to 4, Jose Cermo, a moonshot out to right to bring the Milkmen closer. They were down two going into the ninth. Eight to seven here. Prua Jr. grounds it and it gets by Teeter at first. Two runs come in to score and the Milkmen walk it off and win nine to eight. Here's your schedule for tomorrow. An early game at 4.05 in Sioux Falls. The rest of the action gets underway around 6.30 and 7 o'clock. A five game slate. You can catch any of those five games tomorrow for free at aabaseball.tv or get your tickets through the AA Baseball app. I'm Matt Yazel. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow night.